class tomorrow from 10 with Shireen. That's it from me for today. Have a great weekend, Scotland. Up next, here's Lunchtime Live. Thanks, Stephen. <laughs> 12 o'clock and our main story is this lunchtime storm Eunice causes travel disruption and school closures. We'll bring you the latest traffic and weather conditions from around the country. And Russian troops continue military exercises on the Ukraine border as Kiev's mayor appeals for calm. All that and more here on Lunchtime Live with Hayley Miller and Andrew Black. On digital radio. FM. Your smart speaker. And BBC Sounds. BBC Radio Scotland. Or to come first the news with Victoria Lumsden. Road users are being urged to take care with many routes across the country affected by heavy snow. The Met Office has issued a yellow weather warning which will remain in effect until 6 this evening. More than 100 schools have been closed as a result of the weather mainly in Aberdeenshire and Angus. There are also wind warnings and a risk of flooding in the southwest of the country. The Deputy First Minister John Swinney says the transport network is well prepared for Storm Eunice. The trunk road operating companies and our partners and local authorities have been undertaking extensive gritting operations over the course of the night to try to make sure travel this morning was able to be sustainable on the roads. There's obviously a few problems in different parts of the country, but there are gritters getting to these issues really very quickly and trying to resolve them. But undoubtedly, the advice issued last night about ensuring people check the conditions before they travel is advice that should be followed today in all circumstances. Answers. For the first time, a red weather warning for extremely high winds is in place covering London and parts of the southeast and east of Scotland as Storm Eunice sweeps across the country. It's already hit South Wales and the northern coast of southwest England. Russia says it will test its nuclear forces and launch ballistic. A number of routes in Murray, the A939 at Kurgarf is closed. In Aberdeen, the A90 Aberdeen Western peripheral route is blocked northbound by snow. In Perth and Kinross, the southbound A9 is blocked between Perth and Glen Eagles. In Angus, the A90 southbound at Finavon is closed. And in the Stirling area, the A821 Dukes Pass in Aberfoyle also closed. And Scotland's weather, very wintry day to come as Storm Eunice brings rain, sleet and snow northwards across much of the country. A Met Office yellow warning is in force for southern, central and eastern parts, if especially across higher ground where there's the potential for up to 10 to 20 centimetres of snow. Some strong and gusty winds here too, leading to blizzard conditions at times and the risk of severe gales in the southwest later. Highs of 1 to 5 Celsius. BBC Radio Scotland News. Now let's catch up with all the sports this lunchtime with Andrew Petrie. Well, 